What is a PVC sweep elbow? Uh, sweep elbow is a long radius 90 degree bend. And I've got some examples here I'm going to show you. This is the sweep L fitting or an example an example of a sweep elbow here. And you can see it kind of has a long shape to it versus a short radius 90. So let's put those side by side there. So we've got the sweep and you've got the short radius 90. Now what's significant here is that both of these still have glue ports both on the top and bottom. So these, these aren't a street fitting. They're not a glue port on one side and a spigot port on the other. These are both designed to be glued into, but you know, one of them just takes up more space than the other. If you had all of the space in the world to work with, which one should you use? You should use the one with the longer sweep because it has a better efficiency rating. It has less resist resistance to flow. It will not introduce as much turbulence into the water because the water will hit the curve and kind of rotate around the curve smoothly and evenly. Whereas with a short radius 90, it ha has to negotiate that corner faster. And in doing so, it, it is more likely to introduce some inefficiency in the form of turbulence to the water. Laminar uh, flow for water moves very efficiently, but when you introduce inefficiencies like turbulence, that's where you're going to start to compound efficiency losses throughout your system. If every single time the water reaches the corner or an elbow, it kind of crashes into a brick wall and, you know, gets all discombobulated and then has to reroute and keep moving again down the, you know, downstream. That is just a huge inefficiency that can be avoided entirely by using sweep elbows or even heat bending PVC pipes such that you have these very long radius sweeping bends that you do not interrupt the laminar flow of the water. So both of these are acceptable in swimming pools, sweep elbows or long radius 90s or short radius 90s. These are both acceptable. I have no problem with these at all. The only thing that I ever really have a problem with would be the street fitting, and that's the street elbow. This one has the most resistance to flow. It's kind of like a brick wall inside of there, and so you notice that this one has a glue joint on one side, but a spigot on the other. Basically, that would glue into right there. And this takes up the least amount of room. So if you have to negotiate a turn in the least amount of space possible, this is your go-to fitting, but that should be the only time that you use these. The reality is you see these used all the time. In a lot of plumbing systems, you see these used as the only uh, 90 used, and there's no reason to do that. You don't need to try to save that much space, and it introduces so much inefficiency to the system, it's just not logical to do so. So use either a short radius 90 or even better sweep 90s when available. If you found this information helpful, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you can check out my website, swimmingpoolsteve.com.